My name is Ryan, and uh, I work for a company called The Doe Fund. It's a nonprofit, and what we do is we help formerly incarcerated individuals or maybe folks who were homeless or had drug problems get back on their feet. Now we are testing the vSAN product in our disaster recovery site. We've always considered VMware to be the hypervisor that we want to use. And it's really a no-brainer when the hypervisor that you want to use also includes this virtualized storage. For the Doe Fund, it's the holy grail of storage. Looking into the future, we have a new facility. We would like to use VDI to provide some cost savings. VMware uh, is certainly going to be our platform of choice. The vSAN product allows us to do that cost effectively. It allows us to have redundancy where we need it, not pay for redundancy where we don't need it. We probably wouldn't have been able to plan on implementing VDI for our new facility. It's easy 50, 60, 65 percent cost savings compared to whatever else we could possibly find. With virtual SAN, we get that same sort of flexibility from a storage perspective that we gained from a compute perspective when we went to VMware. Software defined storage from VMware is the holy grail of storage for us and for probably a large number of other, other companies. And this vSAN product does exactly what we need from a redundancy, reliability, and performance perspective, uh, and it allows us to push costs down considerably. We can't do that with any other product. Every product that we've implemented from VMware has been a success. You just have to look at their track record. So as I roll out the private cloud here at the Doe Fund, I'm really looking for three major items. Cost savings, I'm looking for efficiency, I'm looking for ease of use, uh, and I'm looking for the ability to expand when we need to quickly. And that's something that this virtual sand product lets us do in every case. There's a uh, definitely an ROI from a cost savings perspective. It removes that additional layer of complexity and it allows us to roll out very cost effectively additional capacity both in compute and in storage really whenever we want.